You're doing well. You're driving Branscombe mad. But you're forgetting Ulster. Don't you dare say that. My father was shot dead. Three bullets in front of my eyes in our hallway. I mean, I, you know, I, I can't just, you know, fire the head of MI5. They wouldn't let me. You're the Prime Minister, darling. We can do whatever we want, doesn't it? I don't think she reports to me. Everybody reports to you, big man. He tells me everything. That's rather the problem, darling. If you were in full flow in my bed, I might tell you more than was strictly appropriate. Lingerie with great sorrow, monsieur. We have to add on top the V80. Even the very small knickknacks. Oh, for God's sake, Albert, whatever it takes. She's in a fury. I have to give her something. You could stand by your wife. Listen, Serena, I mean, come on. Dame Serena, if you would, Prime Minister. This is a formal discussion. Oh, for God's sake, I didn't slither up the greasy pole to be lectured by MI5 on the virtues of marriage. You've betrayed Ulster. Molly, darling, it's us, you know, it's just us, you and me and our dear little girl. Hergay will look after us. He's strong. I call him my big Russian bear. But I'm your Freddy Teddy. Ow, McCloy, I warn you. Look, 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 be careful. Throw her out, Freddy. Well, I, I, I'm not sure that we've reached that point. It's me or her, Freddy. McCloy, you report to me. Are you ready for me, Sergei? God is with us. He wants to save my people. English don't care about Ulster. Well, I will make Freddy care. <laughs> <laughs>